Hello, welcome back to Feed of Beast Beyond. Today I'm going to be working on making some, making a sponsor. Uh, I added a couple more uh, machines in to slice and splice and the uh, soul batter. Real easy recipe, just need the head. And if you get a sword, you, know, you can see I got beheading on it. It doesn't always give you a head, but gives you a good shot at it. So, I think I'm going to make a power spinal. Uh, I was going to make one from RF tools. And I, actually, I did make one. But, in order to run this guy, you need like 60 bones in a and it's a matter bean. You need six pieces of raw flesh, and you can use any kind of meat, but it was just it it was need a lot of resources. So I need to get a wither uh, spawner going. That seems like that's the thing today. In order to make you know some of the items like uh, extra chilies, make an angel ring. So I'm just going to use Enro for now. See what we need for a power spot. I think I got it. So that's good. You can use uh, any head for up there. See what he's electrical still. And yeah, I'll get that. Let's see. That is. Twenty-two. Just make six of them for now. All right, let's get rid of that. Should eat two of them, and then now we should be able to make this guy. That's a nice setup right here. I do like this. I made a video on uh, RF tools, the storage uh, mod was happening. You can use that thing anywhere in another or anywhere. That's that's cool. Let's get rid of that. This guy. Do two of these. Get rid of these things. Two of these. And a head. These. I think a red thing. Ship click on it, it should go right where you need it. And now we can put the yellow one in. One spawner. Alright, so now what I got is a. Uh, actually, I got one blaze spawner. And I got it out of a. Uh, uh, out of the nether. Matter of fact, I gotta go back there anyways. We need a soul bow. I think I may have made a soul bow. It's a uh, we'll go ahead and make it. 
I think you know. I think I already have. Not married. I do have two. I think I made a couple of them. These are for stuff later on. I started to make them, but you know, the resources wasn't there, so I just stopped and threw it in there. Click. You get big old fat fingers like I got. You tend to do that. Hit every button you just click. Ooh, somebody shoot that. Get out of here. You gonna follow me in? All right. I got the spawner. I had the blaze set up right up here. Then you can break the spawner with just a regular pickaxe. Now the problem is just find the wither. And that might be a little, a little rough. I don't know. I got these boots out of one of the chests up here. Let's give him a fire him up. A little bit of a, a jump boost. Might have already been here. All these hogs are the same. Let's get up here. Oop, no spawner. Move that one with the new one. Let's get another one. Once we come back and destroy it, it won't be. Matter of fact, let's just go ahead and get a blaze going here. Eat something first. That's a little loud. Come on out. And that's all it took. So we got a blaze. I'll use that for, for something else. See if we can find a wither now. I'm going to uh, pause this run around look because last time it took me a half hour to find one. I'll be back. Okay, finally found one. And there he is. Comes out of here. Come on now. That's problems there. Think about it. Probably will. All right. Get back out of here. Yeah, it took about maybe about five minutes to found one. That's not too bad. Let's see what this is. Yeah, I got the volume down pretty low. It might be just my computer hooked up too long. It took me about five minutes to uh, find one, which wasn't too bad that time. All right, so let's clear out some of the things here. Let's see, what's that? That's a blaze. Let's put that in there. I did get some more ore from her. Got a blaze rod. And I'll put that in there. All right, to make this work, we need to combine these two. So we'll press the soul binder. Let that, ooh, excuse me. Let that thing do its thing. Man, my breath. Indigestion or something. I don't know what the heck that was. It's gone now. Okay, so we're going to make a uh, XP vacuum. And let's see, there's two of them. So what I want to make. need 
do Let's see we need to make that and the pearl and iron ingot. Seems like I did that already. That Shift click, I can just go ahead and do it like that. It's easier. I think it's way out there. Let's go ahead and put that in the step aside from there. And so we wrap that in a diamond. XP vacuum and uh, to make the, the electrical steel is I think it's coal obsidian oh I'm just iron I thought it was a uh, electrical steel never mind and then uh, we need a vacuum chain and that's gonna be the same thing and I'm yep, gonna have to get that other it. Oops, and I need to make uh, some end stones. That's gonna be a, another thing because I got a them. Uh, I'll show you in a second. See, that's gonna be iron, iron duty. I need a chest. He's going to put that trap chest in there. I don't know why. Want them and then hammer. Gonna be stuff. And I need to make this guy. Then I need another thing. Actually, that stuff too. Right? Oh, I thought I did. I just made one then. Oh, let's make another one. I can. And there's a the thing. It must be something. Oh, I got two of them now. Always overkill anyways when I make stuff. And let's see if that guy's ready. So we got the wither skeleton. Now we can get, get that cow back. And I made this elevator. Oh, it is the end of pearl wrapped in uh, wool. And this is going to be in my uh, enchanting room whenever we get to it. So I made this uh, anvil. It's real easy to make. Just need some dark steel and put them in the uh, blocks. So we're going to throw this in here and this in here. So backwards. It's going to cost 16. And I had enough to do it. Let me show it back up. And one more thing we need to make. Let's make a float bank. For that and float bank. So I'm thinking of putting all this. Uh, here's where the room I'm gonna have the spawner. And I'll put the float tank in here, and I'll just put a double wall in here. So I can slap that thing down. Okay, what I already have set up. Let me see. Fuck yeah, man. I already have a uh, four solar panel set up. Remember I made stone for this. They're real easy to 
to make, and I don't feel like having to uh, try and keep this up. Oh, we need uh, one more thing. pretty cool. I should be able to make that uh, real easy. I've got the ore. And this thing works pretty dang good. And it drops XP. Good. Let's go make two swords. Let's go make one of these. Okay, let's see, I think we're going to put the grinder right there, I think I want to fake them when I do it, like so, as you see I already have the power wire already ready for the sword. and I just ran it, there's a solar panel set up there, ran them where I need to. Go ahead and get some of the stuff that we're gonna need. Maybe that and that. I made something similar to this on the Scout Factory uh, 3. I did kind of make the spawner the same, but you change this up a little bit. And this is only until we get a better spawner set up, better system. So, the energy conduit is just vibrant. And you know, you make your uh, your binder and then you cook it real easy. As I say, Andrea, it is one of the easiest things to run. Or, or one of the easiest mods to use. And so, oh, we got some. So I think I should be getting some power. Let me get some stone. I keep forgetting I have to click there. Get that couple of them. Alright, so I'm going to put that there. I think I'm just going to come up over top of them. So this is like a little room. And that'll give me a, enough room to box this in a little bit. Now I have to do is make one more machine to. Oops. To cover up. Conduit there. Okay, so you know what? I probably shouldn't have found that out yet. We'll just go ahead and uh, we'll just put him down. Let me back him. So we gotta prime this thing. So that's where this guy's gonna come in at. Put down on top. I'm gonna load my XP onto it. Then we can go to the bottom of this thing. Put it on push. There we go. Now we gotta put it on. Now she's primed. And then let's see, the spawner will be right on top of it. Put that on and activate it a second. And then we can put a factory chest right there. It don't seem right, does it? Let's see. Let's do this 
speed, a better way of doing it. Probably should break that thing. They are pretty tall. Need to come off of one side of this for maybe we'll just go with this one right here. Okay, so that thing's ready. And I just need to figure out how to put this out. This thing here should work in the wall, so how about we just put it beside it? And if we click this and hit the range. It should suck everything in the room into that. Take that range off. We can put in our item conduit. Put that on extract. Oh, he's active. And I sort of channeled out here a little bit. It may kind of some spots that we want to do some things. We can put we'll start here. Put this here. Put that on insert. Let's see, bust that in right over there. Put that on extract. Always active. Then we can take from our item conduit. Side of this, put it here. See if I can get rid of this. I think we'll just bring the chest right here. Let's make a chest. Thing is yeah, I don't like that enough. Let's go ahead and put it right there. Now the thing is to get to the bottom of it. Let's see. Put this on insert. Okay, so that looks wired up pretty good. Then we can take and put our obelisk on top of this. We can configure it. We want this thing on. Cool. And I think the tank you can do that too. Let's see what I mean. Cool. Then on top of it, we can put in push. Tank is empty. Oh, I just realized I forgot to have it. Okay. Now, let's see, what's the next part? So, insulated piston conduit. This thing is four back. Oh, yeah, that don't look too bad. Just chip away at this. And we can come right down in here. So let's put some conduit. Was an alloy. Alright, so let's go see if we, we need one more thing. We need some uh, base cave. 
So I should have some conduit, which is sand gravel and clay. Let's see if I have those. Now we're going to need a painting machine. One painting machine. Man, I kind of ran out of room there. Let's put the paint machine there. One of these. There we go. And then hopefully we'll be able to connect up to that. And this thing is let's see where we at. And it's getting tired. This is a Mercer Engineering and I'm using the hell out of that. And then I can take a lever and I can use the lever onto this instead of just trying to pull on the wall. We got a lever. Got a lever right there. One more to boot. I could use one of these. Ain't that sweet? That just makes it look so much better. You know, you can't even tell it's there. And I think I'm going to need a couple more. I want one for right here. So we can put that on there. I'm going to slap my lever on. And there it is. Oop, and it works. And it works. Let's uh, this thing is filling in the. Hell yeah, look just fine. Now let's go to the floor here. Let me shut the door. I did uh, jack my floor up a little bit. So let's go ahead and uh, I'm going to take out my idling dislocator because it, it's, it's pretty strong. We'll go ahead and turn that on. See if it's dark out. And it is not dark, so that is good. And we'll let it do its thing here for a couple minutes and see if we can get anything. This is touchy. I'm going to wait a room now. So I'm going to uh, let this run for a few and I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. So let's see what we got. I pulled out a block because it didn't seem to be getting anything. But it took a little while for it to make it up here. So. As you see, I still got my XP, and it is working, so we're getting XP, and I'm not sure how much this thing here will actually hold, because I know I can put all mine in there. I just figured I'd have that down there just in case the thing fills up, but we'll have a second one, a backup one. And let's see, we're getting a bunch of useless 
Bane was sore, but we got full well skeleton skulls. We gave him Bane's old drop of evil, which is one thing that I need. The bones, sulfur, and the weather rib. And I think you can take the weather rib to make the head. I'm not sure. Skeleton skull and three, uh, uh, three bones. So, and my next one will be spawning the wither, hopefully, and get some nether stars. So, please subscribe and thanks for watching.